UFC Heavyweight Showdown. Round one is upon us between two of the best fighters in this division. Hard to find anything resembling a clear weakness on either side of the breakdown. There are no weaknesses in these guys. These guys are as well-rounded as they come. They both can wrestle, both can grapple, both can strike. They can do it all. And these are the matchups that we dream of as MMA fans. Ooh, what a punch. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Oh, significant strike attempt there, but a huge block! Wow, what a kick! Oh, straight right! Minutes remain in the round. Just misses with the straight right. Nice straight punch. He's looking for that left hand. Not there. Ooh. Oh. Oh. Oh, straight right. Just over two minutes to go in what has been a furious round one. Oh, he lands a huge knee to the body. That's a crippling shot there. Oh, collar tie. That is, oh man, this dude is good. Oh! Well, he's been good tonight, but he missed with that one. Fourth, we go. Later, oh, right there. Right there. Right there. And somehow, his opponent's chin held up. His opponent's chin held up, but you do not want to be on the receiving end of those types of strikes. We try to establish that jab. Nice punch lands over the top. Timely defense there. Huge block for him. Efficiency with these ground and pound strikes here. And if you're the opponent, you've got to intelligently defend or the referee's going to stop the got to defend. But you can see him now starting the game posture and the intensity at which he's throwing these ground strikes is starting to improve. It's starting to elevate because he knows that he can get the finish. Well, I'm not sure the extent to which he has recovered, but we do see the end of the round. DC talk us through the replay. Well, he's a tough guy. He's going to make it to the stool. He's going to survive unless you put him completely out of there. Unfortunately, he's in there with a guy that does have that ability. All right, round two. He has a commitment to kick it tonight, and it shows. Well, he's been pretty accurate tonight. He's landed some significant strikes, but his corner's looking for him to mix it up a little bit more and just throw more volume. Because they don't see too much of a threat. This guy has to have confidence in knowing that when he extends his combinations, he's still safe, but he's also gonna be able to land. He's gotta be finding that confidence in his mind that all the reps in the training room are going to pay off. You don't really stand after you take a head kick like this. That is such toughness to even be on his feet right now. Now his opponent's 
really on the ropes. His opponent's on beat streak. He's hurt so bad. I don't know what he's going to do to stay in this fight. Oh, no! So holding on to him here, not doing a ton, perhaps just looking to recover. Man, as he landed a high volume of strikes here in round two, definitely picking up the pace after round one. So he got the message from the corner, and now he is taking control of this second round. Ooh, what a punch. now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. He is getting lit up right now, John. Missed with that attempt. Fantastic timing from that beautiful kick. Posturing up now. And now the damage is about to start. Well, he's more than content to work off of his back, DC, where he has been a magician in his UFC career. Oh, and he escapes up to his feet. Very nice. Beautiful punch. the shot to the body. Oh, an educated jab there. I could watch this dude jab all day. I mean, he's so light on his feet, and when he pops that jab, it comes right back. Oh! Entertaining scrap so far. All right, so there's the horn signifying the end of the round. A stunner there with the head strike midway through. Nearly got him out of there for good. Almost got him out of there. He hurt him badly. He had his opponent hurt real bad. Now his opponent's walking back to his corner. Everybody looks confused. They don't know what they're supposed to do to try to change the way that this fight is going. and pace, but you don't have to worry about this guy. He hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. Straight right hand has been a good weapon for him. He misses with it there. He is throwing a fast, straight, hard jab. That's not a feeler jab. That's one that's really knocking the head back. Another one. Yep. Up oh, and the left hand. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection. And these will take their toll as this. Whoa! Now a knee. News hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Just missed with the left there. Ooh, big shot land. Well, he... Oh! oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. So, fighter a little bit stunned, holding on to him now, not doing a ton, just looking to recover. Oh, he's landed a high number of total strikes here in the latter stages of this fight. He's really picked up the pace and landing far more strikes than he did in previous rounds. Big punch land. Ooh. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Oh, he's been working hard defensively, kick block there. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Both fighters exchange in the pocket here. Nice shot. There's 
no give on that leg kick. And a nice job at least staying upright on that. Look at that switch. Beautiful switch. And right there, he's having a blow of the fight. And it was perfect. It was absolutely perfect, John. Great placement on that uppercut. Holding on to him here, not really doing too much, perhaps just looking to recover. Nice punch lands over the top. Punch to the body. No good, it's blocked. All right, so as we await the judges' scorecards, DC will look back at his handiwork. He had it all going from a striking standpoint tonight. Man, he did a great job. It was very entertaining to watch someone be in such a great state of flow, a great flow state in regards to the stand-up. He said that tonight we would be very impressed with his performance, and I am thoroughly impressed. The official decision Ladies is in. It resides with Bruce Buck. We go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. The judges score the contest 30-27, 9-28, and 30-27. Declared the winner by unanimous decision, 50 Well, he did not get the finish that he certainly prioritized.